A very good evening to one and all. At the outset, a hearty welcome to all of you on behalf of Ranjini Fine Arts. Today is a very special concert, the second of the series of concerts as part of Srimati Rajalakshmi Mohan Rao Endowment. On behalf of Ranjini Fine Arts, we are thankful to Sri Rajesh and his family for their generosity in instituting this endowment. On this occasion, it's my honor and privilege to speak a few words about Srimati Rajalakshmi. Srimati Rajalakshmi Mohan Rao was born on 12th December 1917 to Subramanya Iyer in Tripunitra in the erstwhile Cochin state and later married to Tulu Brahmin family of Pejawar Mohan Rao, a civil servant under the British Raj. She had completed her bachelor's in mathematics an uncommon pursuit in those years. Her travels following her husband's career took her all over India before she finally settled down in Madras post his retirement. She was a polyglot, picking up languages from the normal Tamil, Malayalam, English to Hindi, Bengali, Kannada and Tulu. Rajalakshmi was musically trained in Carnatic vocal, Hindustani vocal and veena and what remains of her singing are found only on 78 RPM discs. She seemed to engage across the spectrum of every field with her deeply religious beliefs not descending into the orthodoxy of those times. As it was tempered by her humanity, an Indian classical music exponent who enjoyed dancing at balls at the British times as well as other popular European dances. Her amazing people skills, which allowed her to count among her close friends, senior vocalists, young dancers, children, and socialites of multiple circles to seers and religious mutt administrators. She left her children, grandchildren, and a large number of those she had touched on 20th November 1977, but her memory and example still touches them. Her interest in music was passed on to those in her family who practice it as well as to the deep rasikas in multiple generations. To perform this special concert today, we have a wonderful team of artists, Vidushi Aishwarya Vidya Raghunath, Vidushi H.M. Smita, Vidwan Anur An Anantakrishna Sharma, and Sri Padarao. A few words about the artist. An A-graded artist of the All India Radio and Doordarshan, Aishwarya has the honor of being the disciple of musical stalwarts, Sangeeta Kalacharya, late Srimati Sita Lakshmi Venkateshan, Padma Bhushan, Sri P.S. Narayana Swami, and Sangeeta Kala Sagaram, Srimati Vegavahini Vijayaragavan, thus being molded into the Semangudi Bani and Veena Danamal Bani. Aishwarya was awarded the Government of India Scholarship between the years 2008 to 2010. She has performed in all prestigious sabhas in India and abroad. Her concerts have won rave reviews and has had numerous write-ups, reviews and articles in the country's leading newspapers and magazines. She has won several awards, Yuva Purandara, Best Vocalist at Madras Music Academy, to name a few. Welcome, ma'am. On the violin, we have Vidushi H.M. Smita, a very much sought-after violinist. She is a disciple of Vidwan H.K. Narasimha Murthy and Vidwan H.N. Baskar. She has accompanied all the leading artists and has won several awards, Yuva Pratibha Puraskara, Ananya Puraskara, to name a few. Today is also Vidushi Smita's birthday, so let us all wish her a very happy birthday. <laughs> On Mrudangam, we are fortunate to have today eminent artist Vidwan Anur uh, Anantakrishna Sharma, who is also a music composer and a vocalist. He was initiated to learn Mrudangam by Vidwan, late Sri R. A. Rajagopal, who was a highly accomplished Mridangam and Gattam artist and a senior staff of All India Radio Bangalore. Beginning his long concert career from a young age of 15, 
Shri Ananda Krishna Sharma has created his own style. As an accompanying artist, he has performed with all renowned artists of past and present. He has been appointed as an executive board member of Kalakshetra Chennai by Government of India. He also serves as an executive board member of Center for Performing Arts Grant Scheme, the Ministry of Culture, Government of India. He is also the president of Samskara Bharati Bengaluru. He is considered as one of the most sought after gurus in the field of music, vocal or percussion. Welcome, sir. On Tambura, we have Sri Padarao. He has been accompanying for prominent vocalists for over 58 years. He is a retired postmaster. Welcome.
సుగుణముల్ల చెప్పుకుంటే సుందర రఘురామా సుగుణముల్ల చెప్పుకుంటే సుందర
Dina 
सेव्यम श्रृंगार भव्यम श्रृंगार भाव नवरस भरी तेही गोप कन्या
ರಾಮಚಂದ್ರ ಜನಕ ರಾಜ ಜ ಮನೋಹರ ಮಮತಾಯ ಭೀಷ್ಮರಾಯ ಮಹಿತ ಮಂಗಳು ರಾಮಚಂದ್ರ ಜನಕ ರಾಜ ಜ ಮನೋಹರಾಯ ಮಮಕ ಅಭೀಷ್ಟರಾಯ ಮಹಿತ ಮಂಗಳು ಕೌಸಲೆಯ ಮಂದ ಹಾಸಭೂಷಣಾಯ ಹಾಸವಾದಿ ಚಿಂತ ಸರ್ವರಾಯ ಸರ್ವ ಮಂಗಳು ಮಲ ರೂಪಾಯ ಗಿರಿರ ವೇದ ವೇದಾಯ ಸುಮುಖ ಚಿತ್ರ ಕಾಮಿಕಾಯ ಶುಭ್ರ ಮಂಗಳ ರೂಪಾಯ ಗಿರಿರ ವೇದ ವೇದಾಯ ಸುಮುಖ ಚಿತ್ರ ಕಾಮಿಕಾಯ ಶುಭ್ರ ಮಂಗಳ ರಾಮದಾಸ ಮೃದುಲ ಹೃದಯ ತಾಮರಸ ವಿವಾಸಾಯ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಭದ್ರ ಗಿರಿವರಾಯ ವಿನತ I want to thank the artists uh, for this evening. Um, you know, it was almost six years back that Aishwarya performed here first. Uh, that was our first year of uh, existence, Ranjini Fine Art. And uh, that concert was wonderful. It was an excellent concert then. I was thinking, you know, this little girl at that point in time was <laughs> giving such a scholarly concert performance and then we now today we hear her and it's it is moved leaps and uh, bounds in terms of scholarship in terms of panache and you wear it with a big smile always so that's that's a beautiful <laughs> <laughs> uh, we have had a wonderful evening ashwarya thank you very much for uh, this great performance uh, right from the start right from the selection of the songs to the way each one was delivered uh, the delineation and especially manirangu very rare raga to pick up for uh, raga delineation that was excellent um, you know very very rarely we get to listen to that raga uh, so we all that we can do is uh, collectively pray that you learn more and more and then we wish that we, you know this joy will be there for more and more people in years to come right um going to the birthday girl <laughs> smita she has been here for uh, on a number of occasions and every time we uh, listen to her and we see that progression in terms of uh, her expertise and uh, again the ease of uh, playing and very apt you know she can adapt to various artists uh, so easily so smita thank you very much and i know you are your daughter and husband are waiting for you to take you out for dinner so <laughs> <laughs> so you have a wonderful uh, birthday and a great year ahead as well sir we privilege to have you back with uh, back with us here uh, he is such a source of uh, inspiration uh, not just to the artist community but even to the organizers um you know our relationship goes back many years um and every time he comes here you know there's a this general sharing of uh, knowledge and uh, he he does it so naturally it comes to him intuitively uh, so today we enjoyed your performance so much and uh, we'll have some conversation after this <laughs> to learn more from you uh, thank you very much sir thank you and nothing you know everything starts and uh, ends with the source as they say and uh, the source tambura shripadrao thank you very much for that uh, 
performance. I'd like to invite uh, uh, Mr. Raghu, who is the founder trustee of Ranjiti Fine Arts, to hand over the tambulams to the artist, please. Aishwarya Vidya. Uh, H.M. Smitha. Shivu, sir. The Sri Padra, sir. As we wrap up, uh, uh, thanks to Basavraj for this, uh, for the acoustics and uh, IDFC Bank for sponsoring this program um, and Shobha Lakeview Club for, for this uh, facility here. And all our programs go live um, on shale.com. So if you want to listen to this program over again, it's still there. And uh, every program is going to be uh, telecast live. So with that, I think uh, we'll wrap up this evening. Thank you all for joining us in this celebration. Good night.